welcome back to my channel and a brand new Disney vlog. We are up nice and early today. We've been watching the coronation of the king. We managed to catch the like most important of it um, when he puts the crown on and everything. But we are heading to Magic Kingdom for a very exciting morning. We are doing the Keys to the Kingdom tour which is what something I've always wanted to do. And unfortunately you're not allowed to film or take any photos on it. So and it's for five hours so I will be filming right up until we obviously go on the tour and then after but we're hoping to spend the whole day in Magic Kingdom today I've got a few dresses I would like to take some photos off and we want to get on some rides and watch Happily Ever After for the last time this will be the last time we're probably going to be in Magic Kingdom so we're going to soak up all the magic and everything but yeah we're um, <coughs> we're nearly ready Andy's just doing his teeth and everything and then we're going to head to the bus but it is nearly 10 to 8 and the tour starts at 9 but you need to get there a little bit earlier and we obviously don't want to be rushing for this because it's a very special morning but it's a 5 hour tour, lunch is included um, I believe you get to see some like behind the scenes things of a ride and kind of the um, underneath kind of walkway of Magic Kingdom and stuff so it's going to be a really exciting really inf um, interesting tour and I'll kind of share with you after what we thought of it but yeah let's head to Magic Kingdom that's the good thing about Magic Kingdom it's so busy there's always going to be a bus sometimes even two but yeah let's head to there We've arrived at the Magic Kingdom and we've got to head to the Town Square Theatre to check in 15 minutes before. Probably got about 25 minutes before we've got to do that. So we're probably just going to have a walk down Main Street. Could do. I love walking into this park, <laughs> especially when it's not too busy. That's where we need to check in later, which is also where you can meet Mickey and Tinkerbell. Should we wait in the queue for that? No, I thought we to get all right. First point of call is coffee to fuel our five hour walking tour. Thank you. We've both got Starbucks to fuel us for the first part of our tour. Yeah, very excited. Love the Starbucks, but it's always so busy. So we are just at the Town Square Theatre. We're just finishing our coffees before we check in, and then this is the last time I'll speak to you for five hours. So I shall see you on the other side of us probably being very hot, sweaty and our legs aching but being full of information about Magic Kingdom, so yeah. Very cool. Story. I'll see you in a few seconds but it will be five hours for us. So we've just checked in, we've picked our lunch um, choices, I've gone for a cheeseburger and I've just gone for tacos and I think it is at Peco's Bill which is near um, Big Thunder, I think. We've got our name tags, which we can keep, and our listening devices, and we just checked in round here. Yeah, we're gonna wear these round our necks, and we get to keep these. Yeah, very excited. And they just needed to see some photo ID um, before they checked us in. And we've got a little bottle of water as well to keep us hydrated. Yeah, so excited.
One eternity later. Oh, goodness, Mickey! Look at the time! We should begin the grand celebration! Oh, there are many! I've got a special surprise for ya! You do? Oh, see, uh, I know there's someone you always want to meet from the land of the Mystic Mountains! It's three o'clock, we've been in the park since just before nine. Um, we've been on two rides today, we've been underneath Main Street. But well, we'll talk more okay, about obviously break. the whole thing. I, I realised I literally just went into filming the um, Friendship Fair um, show at the castle. Yeah, absolutely amazing. Our tour guide Andy was incredible with her cast compliment in the forum because he, he was just so knowledgeable and I know that's their job but he, he just made it so enjoyable and so magical yeah we're now going to head back to our resort chill freshen up and head back out and let's go yeah apologies for the uh wobbling about there's an awful lot of people now heading into Magic Kingdom as we head out. We've just come back to the room after our long morning in the Magic Kingdom and look what mouse keeping has done with my manto. <laughs> Love that. Two hours later. Hello, so some time has passed since I even filmed that little clip about Mando being left by the mouse keeping. We have packed the majority of our suitcases. We're not going to talk about it because we don't want to think about going home yet. But, huh? Or stress us out. No, we've got the extra bag that has stuff in it already, but we just wanted to quickly talk to you about our opinions of the Keys to the Kingdom tour. I don't want to go in too much detail about it. I put this on my Instagram as well because I don't want to ruin it for anyone that does want to do it but I would a hundred percent recommend going on it because it's worth every cent you pay because it is such an in-depth knowledgeable and interesting tour especially if you are a big uh, a big Disney fan like me or um, just like Magic Kingdom in general it's just such a good tour we managed to get on two rides which was Haunted Mansion and Jungle Cruise it has restored our faith of Jungle Cruise because we had even the moments where we did have the skipper she was so much better than the one we had last time and she was so funny and stuff as well so and we managed to get on Haunted Mansion literally as a walk on, which was incredible. Uh, the queue for the lightning lane was outside, and we just got, walked straight in. Yeah, there. we got some death looks. But it's always given us looks anyway. <laughs> but yes, it w and we obviously managed to go under Magic Kingdom in the kind of tunnels 
that um, are quite famous but obviously you can't really go down unless you're on a tour or a castle and be yourself so that was really cool and seeing some of the parade floats yeah I won't go into too much our tour guide Andy was absolutely incredible we've put a cast compliment in for him because he was just so knowledgeable so friendly and made it super interesting it was a five hour tour like I've mentioned before so if you are thinking of doing it please wear sensible shoes and equip yourself for walking around the park for five hours i think once it got to kind of the midday point a few of us were flagging a little bit so it was good that they obviously kind of had lunch for us but that was at peco's bill i believe um i kind of done a little clip on my phone and stuff but yeah absolutely brilliant so glad we did it it was such a good way to kind of round off our trip almost um with the second to last day here and yeah we're gonna head back out to magic kingdom after obviously sorting all of our packing stuff out we're gonna probably go and get something to eat have a little bit of a nosy i think we want to get onto the train because we still haven't done that yet i can't believe we've been here for two weeks and we still haven't managed to get on the train but there's just so much to fit in even up with this being our second time you can still find so many things that you just haven't managed to do and then we're going to watch Happily Ever After. I don't know if I'm going to be filming too much of it. I know this vlog is probably going to be a little bit shorter than my other one because we've obviously not been filming as much. But yeah, looking forward to a lovely evening in Magic Kingdom. So let's go. We are back in the Magic Kingdom and walking into it for the last time this trip. So sad. But we're going to make the most of the time we've got here. Oh, it's got very dark. Going through the tunnel. Yeah, we're going to make the most of the time we've got here. And I think we're going to head up to the train, which I'm so excited to go on and share with you. Yeah, I think we're going upstairs. So hopefully get a good shot of Main Street as well and the castle. so we've been able to walk up here last year it was still completely shut off oh this is cool how cool how cool is that Oh well, there's a couple cake coming. Frontierland, and this is what the Splash Mountain queue line is looking like at the moment. I've covered something up there. Oh, 
Times on fixing for something a bit wilder. Big Thunder Mountain is the place. Because there, the trains have a mind of their own. Temporary closed. Dog treats in there. So, 101 Dalmatians. Yeah. How oh, cute. Oh, another, one. another one sleeping there. I've never noticed that in the Emporium they have some windows with some displays on. So you've got Cinderella. Little Mermaid, that is cool. I thought that was a 90s film. Turns out it's 989. How cool. It feels like a tradition that every time we're here to watch fireworks we've got to get Casey's. But we're just waiting for our mobile order. Yeah. Yeah. It's very hard to find a table, especially this well, it's like an hour and a half until fireworks, so we're leaving it quite early. But I think everyone's had the same idea, so we're just right on to there's a duck on the scrounge for food. Not got a duckling, so it's getting well close to you, Annie. Yeah, we're just waiting for our mobile order to come up and we'll find the seat. We've got our hot dogs and our monster drinks. How insanely big are those? And this is our view. Can't get much better than your last evening in Magic Kingdom. Going to enjoy these now. We're getting all of the treats tonight. I'm getting the... We are getting all of our favourite treats tonight. We've had Casey's had still going on this drink. We've got some vanilla ice cream and I've got two cheeseburger spring rolls. We're just near Sunshine Tree Terrace, which is one of our favourite little snack spots. And we're just going to finish these up. The quick service is by far the quickest on mobile order because everyone queues up. Yeah. Rather than I don't think a lot of people know you can mobile order there. But yeah, it's like a little area here. No, it's just getting dark. So yeah, we're going to eat these and then go and find a spot for the fireworks. Have you been to, you, you haven't been to have you? No. That looks exactly like that. So on the Keys to the Kingdom tour, he mentioned about the Liberty Tree, which is one that they moved 
because Walt wanted to have it in the park and also the Liberty Bell is actually one of the last replicas using the original casting of the Liberty Bell. We'll get a little bit closer for you. But Andy said it looks exactly well. Oh, and all the different. Oh, cool. Have you kissed the Liberty Bell, April? Do you kiss it? What's that from? It's from a TV show. We're just coming to the ye old Christmas shop and there's loads of different ornaments. You can get the Main Street, Magic Kingdom train station, Little Mermaid, Peter Pan's flight, which I still don't understand why it has such a long wait. Forest of the Caribbean. Seven minutes by the way, on a Saturday night. Space Mountain. The wait right time. Oh look, you can get a Jungle Cruise one, Seven Dwarfs, I like that one. Even a test track one, the Imagination of Figment. Oh look, a Mickey and Minnie's one. That's a small one. Castle one. Oh, I like the ears, you can get graduations. Oh look, you can get ones that are literally like mine. Ears that I'm wearing. We've just come into Star Traders and there is some new Walt Disney World ears that have all four parks on them. How cool are they? How much are they? Oh, they I thought some them ones either. Are they like Italy ones? Yeah, the Chocolino ones. They're cool. I still yeah, like these ones. Price on I reckon they're probably going to be about $40. You've got the 50th ones there. There's no price on them, mate. They are cool. I do like them, but then am I going to wear them anywhere else but Walt Disney World? The hundred ones I will be able to wear in Disneyland. Oh, 
Our last look at the main hub bit. So sad to be leaving because we don't know when we're going to be back but it's been amazing Magic Kingdom. Magic Kingdom for the last time this trip. It has been such a lovely day, a long day and tiring day. Our feet are aching now so we're very glad to be heading back to the hotel but this is the last time we're going to be seeing Cinderella's Castle. We don't know when we're going to be back to Walt Disney World so we are soaking every little bit of magic up as we can. We have our last full day tomorrow which is going to be an Epcot and Hollywood Studios day which we're so excited about but it always feels a little bit of bittersweet saying goodbye to Magic Kingdom because it is where our holiday has started for the past two trips. It started, yeah it did start in Magic Kingdom for this trip and it started in Magic Kingdom for uh, yeah. the last trip. Yeah. I said I didn't yeah. know where you are going with that. <laughs> but yeah. I'm just going to say my final goodbyes to the castle and head back to our resort and look forward to our last full day in the magic tomorrow but thank you Magic Kingdom for all of your memories this year it's been so lovely to explore you a little bit more and Got learn around. more about you and go on the train that was really nice to go on the train today and go on more of the rides I really was brave this trip and went on a lot more of the rides it was a shame we couldn't go on Big Thunder one last time but it's temporarily closed um, and it has been most of the day so that's a bit of a shame. But yeah, goodbye at Cinderella's Castle. We will see you real soon. Yes, we're going to head back to the hotel. I think I'm going to end this vlog here. And also we've got some giveaway prizes in that bag. I may have treated myself to a few things as well but you'll see that in the vlog. Um, no, no I did not treat myself to more <laughs> pins. It was actually a really nice dress and some ears. To wrap this vlog up, our last one in the Magic Kingdom. Our wristbands are lighting up and everything. Yeah, goodbye Magic Kingdom. We will see you real soon. And thank you so much for watching today's vlog. If you have, aren't subscribed already, please make sure you hit subscribe and hit that like button. And I shall see you next week for our last full day in what Disney World? <laughs> I forgot where we were there. <laughs> I need to go to bed. Bye!